where I'm from. Fingers on the pump, make a six straight jump from SoCal. <laughs> Hey guys, Lala here. So I have a pretty cool DIY project for you and uh, why am I yelling? It's really simple, it's super cheap. If you already have the supplies, you can use anything in substitute of the supplies that I already have. So make it your own, make it fun. But I figure it's kind of a tumbler look which is really popular lately. So what I'm using is um, two sheer curtains. They're see-through, obviously they're sheer. Sheer. <laughs> I went and I bought a bunch of super cheap fake flowers. You can get them from Walmart or Joanne's Fabric, any place, any hobby place like that. So basically what you do is you're going to take the heads of the flowers off. They'll just pop right off the stem and you just leave it like that. And then I'm going to show you, you're going to need your curtains, your flowers and safety pins. And if you're like me and you don't have a curtain rod, tax to hang your curtains. Let's do this. So first thing first, you're going to want to make sure that you don't drop your tacks. I dropped one, couldn't find it until I stepped on it. Next is you're going to want to make sure that you hang your curtains, span the area that you're trying to cover, so either your window or your wall, whichever. I actually ran out of tacks and tried to find a substitute and my husband's gonna hate me for this. You take your flowers and you put them on the front side of the fabric. You turn the fabric over and safety pin the flower to the fabric. Now when you put them on your fabric you want to space them however you desire. You can do them going up like a butterfly you know, like the butterfly pattern. Just make sure you space them out and then party and have fun. Okay, so that's it. It's simple. All you have to do is just pin the flowers to your fabric. I'm doing it as my background, not as an actual curtain for my window. That's because I get horrible lighting where my window is, so and I wanted to have something pretty in my YouTube videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you like this DIY project and want to see any other DIY projects, please comment below. Hit the thumbs up and please subscribe. We'll see you later.